what's up guys welcome back to another video uh today we're going i'm going i'm going i, I can't take you with me because i got in trouble already so i'm gonna go to the bins i'm gonna go to the dallas bins because i woke up late today so i was like you know what i almost wasn't gonna go to the bins i was like i should just go to the thrift stores and see what they have but i was like no nah, i'll get better bang for my buck at the bins so Decided to go to Dallas Bins because it's easier for me to get to, or quicker, I should say. Uh, and I usually don't spend that much time there, usually in and out. Um, yeah, so let me go do that, and then I'll show you what's sold. Or not what's sold, what I picked up. Jack Skellington. All right, so here is my little haul. This is what I found. Let's start off with this little cool Jack Skellington figure here, a little Disney action. Uh, Sandy Claws. And then we got some hats, of course. I saw some lady had a cart full of hats, but I was still able to get some. What does this say? Knowledge point. This is a cool one. Waste management. Finish first with DuPont. This is a cool hat right here. Like that. What else we got? A lot of golf hats. Dodgers. Golf. BB? Baby? BB? BB or baby? Um, toast that's good toast right there Pierce I don't know what that is and yeah some other golf course uh, hats um, and I found some more track for me for the Hot Wheels eventually once I have space I want to build a cool little like um, race track for uh, the Hot Wheels so and I've been keeping an eye out for these I know Dallas or Tendo has a bunch of track for me also so shouldn't be a problem being able to um get it list or get it listed to build that track eventually um i just need somewhere to be able to do it because <laughs> uh need some space all right let's see i got this uh blink one the best of blink 182 step-by-step -step breakdown of tom delong's guitar styles and techniques so it's just like a music book and it still has the CD, and I think if I check correctly, correctly, this goes for like 20 bucks on eBay. So I thought I'd take that with me. Found two lots of uh, two packages of uh, peach peachy uh, portfolios. Do you guys remember these back in the day? Having these back in the back in the Hades, um, and now you would start just drawing things on the on the people or in the background. So yeah, I found two of these. So we'll lock that up, sell them together. Um, let's see. We got some of these uh, little vinyl, what are they called? Vinylmation figures here. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then I have a handful more back here somewhere. Let me see. Right here. Got them right here. So I've been waiting to pick up a few more. The only thing is this one, the ear broke off. So I glued it back on. So I'm going to lot these and the other ones and sell them off that way. And of course, just note that um, those that one has broken here. This little uh, Metal Mutants, Metal Mutants uh, Beast figure right here. And I'm just like, anytime I find action figures or something like that, especially vintage ones, I just uh, hoard them up and then sell them in a the lot eventually. Found these little risk board game little cardboard crates that are full of little figures so they're all full of little figures so i figure i'd be able to lot these together and sell them off right there as replacement pieces replacement pieces or something like that little matchbox car right here that's going to go into the match uh the hot wheels die cast lot uh, a sealed copy of elegy 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 i only got it because it's sealed got some cds Leanne Womack, John and Oates, or Hall and Oates, sorry, Hall and Oates, and this is original master recording, got that one, same Chicago, this one's numbered, oh they're both numbered, Julie Larson, George Harrison, the best of George Harrison, uh, here comes the sun, while my guitar gently weeps, my sweet lord, yeah. I got this because it's sealed also the band 
of I, I, the Irish Guards. And then the Who, Tommy. And that's pretty much what I, oh, and I got this uh, CD player right here. I'm gonna pop some batteries in there and see if it works. It's pretty clean. Just maybe, maybe, maybe get a couple bucks out of it. I only paid $10 for all this here, so we got more than that in hats. So that's, that was pretty awesome. And if this goes for 20 bucks, that should be pretty cool. And I've seen that some lots of these go for decent money. So we should be able to get make some pretty good money back. Now, the only thing is how long will stuff take to sell? I don't know. I'll let you know. So eBay sales, eBay sales started off uh, pretty, pretty decent this morning. But then somewhere in the afternoon, they died out and haven't really had any offers or anything sell. So... Uh, who knows what happened, but I just listed about 30 items. Uh, so hopefully that, uh, I don't know, hopefully people are looking for that stuff and they find it. Um, yeah, but I got, and I also had three items sell overnight. So that was cool. Uh, like I said, I like waking up and checking my phone and um, seeing that there's items that sold over and overnight. But right now we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight items going out. Two, four, six, eight items going out. Seven of them are from eBay and one is from Poshmark. All right, here we go. First item is this Stefan, 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 I'm gonna say Stefan, Grappelli Young Django uh, cassette right here. That sold for 550 plus shipping. And we got this VN um, golf hat sold for 9.99 plus shipping. Panther City lacrosse uh, hat sold for eleven eighty nine plus shipping. We got the Johnny Rivers LP back here that sold for five fifty plus shipping, and we have a little plush bear right here. I've had this guy forever. Vintage Fiesta, um, black and brown, nineteen eighty nine Fiesta bear right there. Sold for ten dollars plus shipping. And we got this vintage NRA blue trucker hat. I kept it in here because the foam inside is like falling out. I, I made sure I put that in the listing. Uh, so there's no surprises there. Uh, that sold for $15 plus shipping. And then sold this Red Hot Chili Peppers t-shirt. This is a common Red Hot Chili, uh, Chili Peppers t-shirt. This is like the first shirt I bought when I decided to jump onto Depop and uh, list t-shirts there. So it actually sold on eBay um, and I've had it for a while. So much I was excited when it sold. So that was awesome. That sold for uh, $12.59 plus shipping. So that is awesome. Uh, as far as Depop goes, I know somebody was asking about Depop. We really haven't kept up with it much lately. Um, yeah, I don't know what the plan is. But uh, for, as of right now, we're kind of just focusing on, on eBay pretty much. On Poshmark, sold this hat right here, UTEP Football, uh, University of El Paso, I think it is. And it's it seems to be signed by one of the coaches. Uh, the only reason I know that is because somebody actually messaged me on eBay and told me who the person was that signed it and that they were a popular coach from El Paso. Uh, yeah, I didn't put any of that info, though, in because I don't know if, that really, if that's true or not, so... I just said it's a UTEP football hat and that's it. And it sold on Poshmark for $13 uh, plus shipping. Cool. And that's it for today's video, guys. Um, hopefully, I think my next trip out will go to uh, Fort Worth. And it's been probably over a week since I've been there. Because I think last week I went to Dallas all week. Or three day, two or three days. I'm not sure. I don't remember. Um, so I'll probably go to Fort Worth next and uh, hopefully we get some more hats more anything I could sell you know um, so I think that'll be the next stop and uh, yeah that's it hopefully uh, thanks for watching guys thanks to all the new subscribers hopefully you guys stick around hit that thumbs up button and I'll see you in the next video